I really like school because it's just like a place where we all have to go every single day. The only thing is just waking up in the morning. <laughs> At my old school, I'm not sure if I fit in or not, but I definitely feel like I have a place here. My favorite thing about Friends Central is the teacher's connection to the students. They don't just care about you as a student, they care about you as a person. It was incredibly mind-opening to just arrive here and be like, whoa, all these kids are amazing, all these teachers are amazing, everything is amazing about the school. Yeah. It's really important to understand middle school as a developmental stage. They are really ready cognitively, and brain science tells us this, to take these leaps in abstract and critical thinking. So the work that we do in middle school is designed to really engage that natural curiosity and to help them develop those um, higher level thinking skills that they will need as they proceed on into high school. When we think about the end game for, for our students at Friends Central. It's to reach the highest level of their intellectual capacities, but also to make them good people. Teachers, we believe, they guide students to that place of discovery, but we don't provide them with the answers. This story, this story makes history, people. So what do you think would be the answer when Claudia says, hey, what are you carrying? And you go, I'm carrying a nerd. Perfect. Good. We challenge kids, uh, I think, to the highest level of their intellectual capacities. That's what we do in middle school. But we also have the unbelievable opportunity to nurture the whole child. One of the skills we work really hard on in middle school is self-advocacy. How you ask for help, how to get the help you need. When we send students on to the upper school and beyond, students are really ready to go to office hours or to meet with a teacher outside of class because that's what they understand is part of their job as a student. I don't have to walk away from a class confused or unsure about what I learned. Being able to talk to them um, is extremely helpful for me and for, I think, everyone. We don't just leave it to chance. There's a time built into the day. That's part of the advisory system. The most important job that teachers have outside of teaching is to be a phenomenal advisor to young people. Are you expert enough to understand and to be responsive to their needs, be it academic needs, be it social emotional needs, be it their intellectual needs? You learn pretty quickly at Friend Central that it's okay to make mistakes and be wrong because that's where the real learning and growth happens. Every Wednesday, we stop our normal academic schedule and we do service from 10.30 to 12. And students are able to choose from a variety of service projects. This service has been going on for probably 30 years. Some of the things we do include removing invasive plants. We also plant shrubs and trees, look after the stream, test for nitrates and phosphates and dissolved oxygen. And they can be outside in the fresh air uh, and, and get their hands dirty, which is what it's all about. When I'm a parent and I come back, it's going to be like ginormous. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Middle school, I think, is a time when you're really finding the basic parts of your identity. You're developing just who you are as a person. How do you build confidence in young people at their most vulnerable stage? That requires self-reflection, awareness, um, being in relationship with other people, but also tending to oneself as an individual. Every student takes part in affinity groups. You pick a part of your identity that you love to dive into with other students. I really love affinity groups because there are a lot of stereotypes and I'm a very opinionated person and I like that we get to talk about stereotypes and how we feel. That we're valuing understanding oneself and having um, the opportunity to also take other perspectives and that's absolutely an essential part of the curriculum, perspective taking. I feel like we all know what we want to be but I don't think we know what we actually are because we're all just like trying to figure out middle school. To tackle the issues that I think we face in this society, uh, you have to be intellectual, right? And you have to be able to problem solve. And you have to be curious and innovative in ways to problem solve. Instead of telling kids how to do it, right? Provide them with the tools so that they can discover that on their own. Our students are positioned to be incredibly successful in whatever fields they choose. Everything from the curriculum to the program is really designed to prepare them for the steps that are next after middle school. I know that I would not be who I am today. I would not be a leader. I wouldn't be 
on the girls varsity soccer team, I wouldn't be the student I am without the support I had in middle school.